Hey guys, this is Abhishek from GadgetSuit.com and today we are going to do a benchmark review of the Lenovo K900. Here we have the device with us and as you can see the device is fairly good in terms of the overall design. You have a metal back at this side and you have 13 megapixel camera with dual LED flash and when it comes to the processor which we have on this device you have Intel Z2580 dual core processor uh, which is a 2 gigahertz processor uh, which we have on this device and it does have the Intel hyper threading technology to boost the overall performance on this device and we have just ran the quadrant standard benchmark utility on this device uh, when we talk about the RAM which we have on this device you have 2 GB of RAM on this device so as far as the specifications are concerned this device is fairly good you have 5.5 inch of display and let me just give you the information about the benchmark in quadrant standard this device has actually scored 5997 which is quite an impressive score as you can see and this is how the detailed score looks like as you can see uh, you have the total score you have the cpu you have the memory you have the input output operation the 2d and 3d and again these scores are fairly impressive when it comes to the ranking the device is fairly good in terms of the overall ranking as well it is on the top in terms of the ranking and let me just go back and show you some other information about the device so if we go into the system information you have the lenovo k9 100 underscore row which is the model number of the device and then we have a 2 gigahertz processor on this device you have a quad core processor uh, however it is mentioned as dual core uh, in the specifications and it has a dual core processor which is again an intel cover trade processor as you can see as far as the information which we have over here but it is showing that the processor has four cores although the processor is dual core the reason for this information is that because of the hyper threading technology it is also counting the virtual two cores which are being emulated over this uh, over the cpu the display resolution on this device is a high definition a full high definition display which you see on the device you have 1080 into 1920 resolution display on this device as you can see a power vr stx544 mp processor on this device you have all the sensor information as you can see so you have a 3-axis accelerometer sensor the gravity sensor uh, the the magnetic sensor, orientation sensor, gyro sensor, linear rotation, proximity, light and uh, this additional sensor from Lenovo. So if we take a look over the score for the N22 benchmark utility, we ran that utility as well on this device and the score is again quite impressive on this device as you can see. So it is 27940 which is a really impressive score and if we take a look over the detail scores over here, this is how the detail score looked like and the RAM and CPU has performed really well in this particular test as you can see. So the score is pretty good. If we take a look over the bar chart over here, again this is a prototype device so uh, once the device is going to come in the market you can expect a better score again and when it comes to the nina mark utility the score which we have got is again quite impressive you have got 60.1 fps so that means this is this device is capable of running all the graphic intensive game including modern combat 4 modern combat 3 uh dead trigger frontline commando and all those games and the casual, casual game should run pretty fine on this device without any issues and we will let you know more during our detailed review when it comes to the multi-touch, this device supports 10-point multi-touch as you can see. Uh, we like this device as far as the initial expressions are concerned. We will let you know more information about this device. Do let us know if you have any specific question for this device. We would love to help you. You can like this video. This video helps you by clicking the like button below. You can subscribe to our YouTube video channel for more videos like this by clicking the subscribe button below. Thanks for watching this video. This is Abhishek signing off. Thank you review of the Lenovo K900 device is concerned. Uh, we like this device as far as the initial expressions are concerned. We will let you know more information about this device. Do let us know if you have any specific question for this device. We would love to help you. You can